Hey, what's up travelers? In this video, we're going to see something really awesome. We're going to this place right behind me, Abu Chakra, and uh, we're going to have a great meal. So check it out. Well, I'll leave it to me to uh, forget my microphone, so if the audio is trash, I apologize. <laughs> this place, man, look at this view. It is absolutely fantastic. Easily the best view to eat a meal with in the entire world, in my opinion. So excited to be here in Giza, it's absolutely amazing. Last year at New Year's, I made a New Year's resolution that I was going to be at the pyramids for New Year's 2022, and uh, I made it. I was totally here. You may have already seen the live stream that I did when, uh, when they do the fireworks at the pyramids. Hopefully, it's, it's scheduled that's like an 80% chance of rain. <laughs> uh, but that's in two days, so a lot can change by then. You know, raining in the desert. Who, who would have thought? <laughs> I am waiting to order here at Abu Chakra. This place opened in 1947. And hopefully they get here and take my order soon. Uh, and then we'll see what happens when that happens. So check out this view some more. All right, so we just got the lentil soup that I ordered. So I think it was 22 Egyptian pounds, I think. It's uh, nice and runny. Uh, so it's, it's, it's not like something that comes out of a sick baby. <laughs> Kind of lukewarm, wasn't really expecting that. Uh, very flavorful though. Uh, you can, it's, you can definitely feel the the grit of the of the lentils, but uh, I mean, there's definitely a lot of uh, cinnamon and you know, something else going on in there. I'm not really sure of all the spices they use here in Egypt, but they use some good ones. <laughs> uh, I definitely think this would be better if it was a little bit warmer, but it's still very good. Well, until the next plate shows up.
Oh, there it is. Well, I ordered the Mixed Grill Plus. Uh, I should be getting a Pepsi here, too. Uh, don't know when that's going to get here. Uh, yeah, they, since COVID, they wrap everything up like this now, so that's fun. So yeah, I got the Mixed Grill. It's got Kafka. I'm not sure what meat that is. Probably lamb, maybe beef. And then some grilled chicken. More grilled chicken. More grilled chicken. <laughs> and, and then uh, some, some veggies. Uh, looks like some carrots and some cucumbers. Uh, maybe pickled. Who knows? Let's get after this mystery meat. Yeah, it's definitely lamb. So, the char on that is absolutely fantastic. I am... This is food that you can just fall in love with. Oh, man. Move on to a piece of this Kafka. <laughs> kind of looks like a turd. <laughs> That is amazing. I'm guessing probably a beef sausage. And it is just spiced to perfection. Oh man. It's got the perfect amount of grease to it. It's so good. I guess we'll go for some of this chicken here. That is good chicken. So two of these pieces of chicken were kebab, and then one is just a chicken breast. I don't know if they're gonna taste any different, but we'll find out. Let's try this rice here. Oh man. That was like an explosion of cinnamon and licorice <laughs> that is that's some of the best rice i've ever had in my life mm. Man, that is good I'll go ahead and try some of these carrots not pickled just steamed uh, not steamed heavily though. Uh, just barely caught it. <laughs> mm. that <was> mostly bone. <laughs> Definitely was not expecting that to be bone. <laughs> Very flavorful though. Let's try this again. Nice, nice piece of thigh, I think. Mm. That is so moist and just delicious, perfectly cooked, a little bit spicy. Um, that's the first thing that was really spicy in this, in this rice though, man. Everything has been absolutely fantastic, but this rice, is the showstopper. Mm, man. And when I got in here, this place was packed. Probably 40 people in here. Maybe 15. Got a lot quieter. <laughs> That is not cough, but we will be having some dessert. 
maybe even some Turkish coffee. Stick around, and we'll get into that. And uh, go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, it really helps me out. I really appreciate it. See you in a few. So I'm not entirely sure what this is called. He said it to me, I said it back to him, and then I forgot. But it's uh, some sort of a vanilla pudding, and then I think they got some cinnamon to sprinkle over the top of it. So let's see. Woo, that went a little bit heavy right there. <laughs> oh well, spread it out here. Probably not too bad of a deal. Take these chunks out. <laughs> All right, let's, let's get them to go. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. It's, it's a nice, firm uh, vanilla pudding. And then that was cinnamon and I sprinkled over the top of it. And it is delicious. I'm just waiting on my Turkish coffee. And then the meal will be over. <laughs> Sad days. <laughs> this pudding, it's not, it's not too sweet. It's got some sweetness to it. Uh, but it's not overpowering. Probably wouldn't mess with your uh, glycemic index at all. Really good stuff. Well, the coffee is here. <laughs> yeah, nice Turkish coffee. I wonder if it's had enough time to settle yet. It's interesting. They definitely uh, added some stuff to it. I, I asked for no sugar. It's sweet. Um, but it's got something else in it. It's some sort of a floral flavor to it. Almost, almost minty. Ugh. Honestly. This may be the worst cup of coffee I've ever had. <laughs> yeah, not good. <laughs> so that entire meal ended up costing 260 Egyptian pounds. Uh, the conversion rate is about 15 pounds for every dollar. I haven't done the math yet, but I will put that right here in dollars. So yeah, that's that's the price that that meal cost. Again, if you've enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell so you know whenever I upload a new video. And as always, so well, usually I say eat great food, but food's gone, so... Uh, drink bad coffee or something. <laughs>